So as we all know, Fortnite is no stranger to large scale events. We've had meteors literally hit the map. We've had old and new locations taken away and given back to us. Hell, we even had a robot take on a giant monster. And if that isn't enough, we had a black hole literally consume the game for about 84 years and come back with a whole new map. In the recent times, we have the Doomsday Live event right around the corner, which has been leaked to us repeatedly, but it appears that a spanner in the works has been thrown. And that is in the form of a brand new concert, a brand new live event known as the Travis Scott concert. And in this video, we are going to be going over every single leak, including the most recent ones that have been announced today. We're going to be going over in-game changes, locations of this venue, and how we know that Travis Scott is going to be arriving in Fortnite very, very soon. Now, the support on this channel recently has been incredible. Like, you guys are literally goated. Hell, I'm almost on 2,000 subscribers, which honestly blows my mind. If you guys could please keep this going and make sure you hit that subscription with the notification bell, then I'm sure the Travis Scott skin will be in the item shop tonight. In the words of Travis Scott, let's get into the video. It's lit. Now, as you would have seen in the title, this is why you guys clicked on this video, and that is the Travis Scott event. Now, I'm not quite sure how we ever got to this situation, but it's here, and Travis is coming to the world of Fortnite. Now, as we all know, Travis Scott is a massive fan of Fortnite, ranging from playing with Ninja back in the day to asking Juju for that iconic Band-Aid clip, which we all know about. Juju, you got Band-Aids? Band-Aids? Now, all of these rumors came around in February when Lucas7 Yoshi leaked a picture of a string titled Travis Scott, which I imagine an Epic employee probably did a bit of an oopsie about and wasn't meant to do that. Now, multiple people simply thought this was going to be a quick little cosmetic, maybe a skin or an emote, but in fact, a 37 megabyte encrypted pack was found, which made people think that this could be the brand new Marshmallow live event concert, but as the Travis Scott version. Now, an image we had in-game which made people go absolutely mental to do with this is Shiner PR's picture of a rumoured Travis Scott skin in-game, which, to be honest with you, looks pretty authentic, and I believe it is real. However, it was never actually released to the game. Now, this all happened in February, and since then, it pretty much just fell flat. Like, nobody mentioned it again, everything went on to Doomsday, and the Travis Scott skin and event seemed to just take a massive L until... Now, boys. Now, previously, we have had live concerts such as the Marshmallow event, which obviously was a great success to me. It was by far the best event I've ever witnessed in Fortnite. Being able to fly around and listen to that concert, damn, it was fun. So it makes logical sense. It was such a success the first time around, so why wouldn't you do it again, especially with someone like Travis Scott, which everybody absolutely loves. Now, in recent times, we had a file known as the Jerky event leaked to us. Now, that made absolutely no sense whatsoever, but it turns out today that, that Jerky event is, in fact, the Travis Scott event and not the Doomsday event, which means between now and the delayed season end, it looks like we could be having two live events, boys. Now, additionally today, Tiger Hype X and Fortori actually managed to get hold of some images of the Jerky Island. Now, he's got two quite close-up images. Images, but also this very very high quality video now along the side of the jerky okay. island you can see a host of different fairground rides which is iconic for travis scott's astro world album or alternatively they could just like mushrooms in the middle we can obviously see a speaker which is again further emphasizing that this is for the travis scott event so this is fully confirmed and it looks like it's going to be happening very very soon now, what is also interesting about this jerky island is if you have a look at it in game by aiming at the planet, you will hear a song. Now, that song, for any of you Travis Scott fans out there, will be fairly obvious. But if not, it's actually the end of the highest in the room song. Again, confirming that this is linked with Travis Scott and an event, skin and cosmetics are coming to the game imminently. Now, what has also been confirmed to us is, in oh, fact, that this is a U-map, which means that this planet will come closer and closer until eventually it hits the Fortnite Earth and then takes over Sweaty Sand. 
lands. So with this, you'd be expecting a host of different Astro World Travis Scott themed attractions to be happening in the sweaty sands and affecting the actual Fortnite world in terms of proper map changes. Now this is all obviously very, very exciting. It's going to be interesting to see how this develops over the next few days. And what was leaked today is this poster. Now this is an in-game poster which I believe is going to be entering Fortnite very, very soon. So keep an eye out on the walls and your surroundings. So when you see this map to head to the location because it looks like we are going to be getting the in-game clues starting to arrive in Fortnite. In fact, scratch that, it appears that they are now in the game in Slurpy Swamp and Risky Reel. So keep an eye out for more of these to appear along with further in-game clues. Now if we look to the background of the poster, it in fact is the map of Fortnite. So we can see the actual location as to what is going to be going on and where this concert is going to be happening. Now if we zoom it out a little bit and actually take a look at the map, we can see it's appearing at Sweaty Sands at its own little island, which is yet to be added to the game and be built properly. Now Fortery, the absolute goat, actually managed to get into the LTM, but it appears that all he could see was the safe zone around Sweaty Sands and a U-map for a 19 by 19 island related to the event that in fact has not been built yet. So expect over the next few weeks for this map to eventually get leaked to us, which I of course will be reporting back to you guys. But it looks like this Travis Scott event is right around the corner and is going to be happening in Sweaty Sands. So keep an eye out for that poster. Keep an eye out on the item shop because a Travis Scott skin is on the way and I believe there could be some emotes so hopefully the sicko mode emote is also going to be included. Now what I expect this event to be like is similar to how Marshmallow was set up where we land into an LTM, the concert has a final countdown where we'll all probably start just shooting each other before and till it starts. Immunity will then be granted so everybody can just enjoy the concert. I imagine then Travis will come on with his obviously own Fortnite skin and start playing his absolute bangers to us from the Astro World album. Or potentially, he could even showcase a brand new song. Now that would be insane. Or maybe there's gonna be a Fortnite song. But yeah, let's just let's not get ahead of ourselves. Now I know you guys are probably wondering for a release date. Now, of course, I have an inkling of when this could be happening. So make sure you sit back, grab your coffee, carry on watching the video, and let's jump into it. So on a recent video of mine, I outlined that if you go to the Shark Prison POI and go to where the cells are, you will notice that a prisoner has in fact escaped and broken a hole in the wall. If we take a look at that wall, we can see a calendar. Now this calendar is actually in fact pointing to the 31st of May. We know that this is May and not April because there's 31 days in May and there's 30 days in April. And given the fact that the brand new season of Fortnite starts on the 4th of June, this aligns absolutely perfectly. Now, if we take a few weeks back from the 31st of May, you'll notice a birthday cake and a pizza actually appearing on the calendar as well. Now, my guess at this Travis Scott event will be falling on one of those days. Now, if we look at that 31st date and jump back a couple of weeks, you will see a birthday cake and a pizza. Now, what I believe is that this Travis Scott event will fall on one of these days being the birthday cake or the pizza. However, I cannot confirm to you which one yet. I imagine that it'll be some sort of party and that is why and when he is going to be performing in Fortnite. However, another theory of mine is that Travis Scott's actual birthday is on the 30th of April and it would be partially fitting given the fact that these leaks have just come around now that potentially we could also be getting this Travis Scott concert on the 30th of April to celebrate Travis's 27th birthday. But this is absolutely everything we know on the Travis Scott event to date from old news to new news. I am gonna be covering absolutely everything to do with Fortnite, the Travis Scott event, the Doomsday event. So if this sounds of interest and you want to stay tuned with absolutely everything Fortnite, then please do not forget to let me know that you enjoyed the video by dropping this video a like. Subscribe to the channel with notifications on so you do not ever miss a video. And let me know what you think in the comments section below. I will hopefully see you guys in the next one. Peace.